which dress was $300 because I only show one dress and it was $228. So you have to factor in that if you buy that $220 dress, you would wear it more if it really fits you. And my whole goal is to have you buy less and wear more of the stuff you have. And you factor in the cost per wear of how many times you wear it a year. Factor in how many years you'll be wearing it. Compared to you buying 10 shitty dresses that will cost just as much that you will throw out that you or leave in your closet because you don't really like it or you donate it because again you don't like it so factor in that and then you see the value of that dress for $228 so that's what I'm trying to teach you I'm not trying to teach you to buy 10 disposable dresses I'm trying to teach you to invest in quality fashion not a ridiculous designer prices by the way these are fair price dresses for people who have are working for the brand that get paid for people who are sewing they get paid and there's a lot of just logistics of behind it companies have to pay rent people who, who work for these companies they also need to pay rent so there's a lot of factors in that factoring in because you're so used to the mindset of fast fashion selling you you know a dress and then next month you're gonna buy another dress because there's another dress that you need to have and you don't need to have it so that's what I'm trying to teach you. I'm not trying to teach you to go and spend $300 to get 10 dresses. I'm saying you should spend $300, which isn't the case anyway. It's $228. Get the $228 dress. Wear it more. Love it more. And wear it for longer. That's my whole purpose of doing these videos.